folks, Bob Dale, Jackson Lee Sales from Jackson, Mississippi, where we sell motorhomes, we sell lots of other folks, we sell them only on eBay. All of our motorhomes, folks, are bank repossessions. They're bought all over the country. They're driven anywhere between 400 and 1,100 miles home. And that has value, folks. It has lots of value. You go to a motorhome dealer and you buy a motorhome, you don't know if it's been sitting there two, three years. Lots of them keep inventory up to four years, five years. You buy one from an individual, you're taking his word, hey, I use it. You don't know it's been sitting there two years, slowly rotting away. You buy one from us, you can look at the sales card, folks. You can see what bank owned it and exactly where it drove from and how long ago. And generally, it will be less than two weeks. Today, we're going to list a motorhome that we like a lot. It's a motorhome people ask for. It's a motorhome that's as nice and clean as one can be. But yes, it's not going to cost you part of your child, children's future to buy. It is a 2006 Sunseeker by Forest River. A 2006 Sunseeker by Forest River. It's on a Ford E450 chassis. It's only got nine, uh, I believe a little over 9,000 miles on it. We'll verify on the inside. The generator's only got 300 hours on it. You can see right now, we'll do a walk around. Glass is perfect, there's no pecs or pins in it. I want you to look at these tires, folks. Michelin's, you know, I say these are 95%. If you don't want to take my percentiles, don't be it. They show no dry rot, all the treads are all there. Look inside here, it's brand new. The radio's playing, let me turn this off and tell you again. It has 9,436 miles on it. The dash air is ice cold. We'll show up inside. There's your backup camera. It's pretty cool. It works. Let me get out of the way, Brandon, and show this right here. These seats, folks, are leather and suede, and just as nice as they can be. Matter of fact, they're like new. What's this motorhome is? Now, I will show you. So you can't bust to get here. We've not waxed it or buffed it. It needs a buffing, but we don't have anybody to do this. Some of these, some of these stripes have a little cracking in them, which is common to all of them outside. We've got the storage doors open. See how clean that is? Look at this back tire here, Brandon. You see they're matching Michelin tires, folks. We've got it plugged up to external power. There it is, that's pass-through storage. There's lights in it and everything. Look down the side, see there's no D-lamp. Never been backed into anything. It's got a spare on it. It fits up and holding air right now. As a matter of fact, it's never been on the ground. There's a spare, folks, that came with this. It is a sun seeker by Forest River, you can see here. This bumper is where you keep your sewage hoses if you want to. Can look through here and see your storage and hook up for whatever you want to hook up. You can look down the side and see there's absolutely no, no D land. Nice colors. The engine is running. We're just letting it run to show you that it doesn't do anything wrong. And basically it's running because the guys forgot to turn it off. Since we have it plugged up <laughs> externally, there's no need for it to be running, but that's okay. Here we have storage. Right here, here's your propane in front, there's the gas, uh, it's a 2900, see the step working, it's a Forest River 2900. Now I don't know folks, here's a cockpit, and it has had no leaks. That's all solid, see that? It's one of the few Class C's you'll ever see it's had no leaks. We're not hiding anything under there. See that? No leaks, and it has done some rain here. Here's the cockpit. You can see how immaculate and new it is. The radio's on. The dash air is ice cold. 9,000 miles. Here's your backup camera. Now, we don't know how this works, folks. There's your TV antenna. You can see around the fence. It's dirty there. It's from the outside, stuff in there, but it doesn't leak. 
We don't know if this was ordered this way. I assume it was, or if someone customized it. But there's no dinette in this, and I'm assuming because there's cup holders, they ordered it with this right here, and a couple of little folding chairs to sit here, and that's where you eat, which is great anyway. You don't have all the room taken up by nine inch you don't use. I would assume someone's going to set a rocker recliner here, which we may or may not do ourselves. It'd be a good idea. Down here you have a little storage item, so that's exactly what they did. They didn't want the dinette using up their space, so they just had themselves a, a, a counter put in here to eat with it. We showed you the electric steps works. Here's your control panel. Refrigerator's on and cold. It's on, I mean, it's, it's just had so little use. I mean, you can see right here, his refrigerator, I mean, has that stove ever been turned on? Nope. Stove's never been turned on, folks. It's a magic shift, never been used, apparently. Oven, never been used. We haven't turned the water, water on. You see all the lights working? There's your little cool deal, the water's working. Your paper towel. They have just maximized the space in this thing to perfection. Uh, showed you the refrigerator, how clean it is. The storage everywhere. Big shower. Big shower. Uh, matter of fact, it's a real big shower. You can see up here it's not leaked, how clean it is. Ah, it's been used very little. This is a, uh, a divider to give you some privacy back here. A, uh, a nice size bathroom. We didn't turn on the lights. See the lights? Look at all the space in there. Once again, up around here, show you that uh, it's not leaked. There's not a leak anywhere. And I'm trying to figure out how to say this grocery. That, that commode, it commodes, you got enough room in there for a, a larger than average sized person to use the bathroom, yes. which a lot of these don't. Uh, nice size bedroom, walk around the bed. This thing's tall in here, isn't it? What is this, eight foot tall? At least eight. Huh. For your television, all your hookups and everything, cable hookups. Right here, your air conditioning, heat and air controls. Not a speck, a big closet, the same, we can show that over there. Not a speck of water. I mean, it's pretty unusual for class C folks. It's a 2006 Lonnie, 9,000 miles on it. Uh, good bed. This is a nice class C, huh? Nice one. I have Brandon helping me today instead of my son, so you see how smooth and everything this has gone. Nice motor home. Nice motor home. We're going to list this tonight, folks. Uh, we're going to list it tonight. It's a 2900. It is a Forest River. Only has, it's a, on an E450 chassis. Uh, only got 9,000 miles on it. The uh, generator is an on end generator. It has 300 hours on it. Uh, everything on it works. Has an updated, upgraded uh, uh, interior package. Just leather and suede did not come in these from the factory, I can assure you. It has a great bed here. Okay, this is all, it's all original. Here's your books. You can see the oven's not been used, the microwave has not been used, stove, the refrigerator looks new, it looks new throughout. But anyway, we'll list it tonight, folks. It will be a bargain. I promise you, you won't have to you won't have to worry about spending a fortune to have you a nice motorhome that you can go anywhere. An 06 with 9,000 miles on it, sitting on a brand new set of Michelin tires. Trust me, that will work. But anyhow, uh, my name's Bob Dale. My phone number is 601-218-1223. 601-218-1223. If you have a question about this motorhome, call me. Answer my phone all the time, night, evening, morning time, weekends. If I, in fact, don't answer the phone, it's because I'm on the phone. 
and I will call you back very shortly. Sometimes I get 140 pitch phone calls a day. But uh, if, you, if you have a question about it, ask. If you want to make an offer for it, please do, because we reserve the right to sell before the sale's over, not to GD Bank, because we either move, do everything, leave each other feedback. We stay straight with eBay, it's where we make our living. And, but if you want to make an offer, you give me a call. Uh, this motorhome will not see the end of the sale. We reserve the right to sell before the sale's over, and we pretty much generally always do. But uh, anyway, uh, it's, it's going to be listed. It's about as nice a Class C as you can find, especially, I mean, you can see the dash, see it. I mean, how can one be any nicer? But we're going to list it, 06 Forest River Sunseeker, 2,900, 9,000 miles, 200 hours on the generator, uh, uh, just as nice as one can be on a black new set of missions. Uh, folks, we do in fact appreciate you for bidding on our motorhomes. We appreciate our many customers all around the world. We sold now nearly a thousand and fifty motorhomes in the past six, seven, eight years. And we look forward to seeing you here in Jackson, Mississippi. Thank you.